Hello and welcome to the first video in our DaVinci Resolve tutorial playlist. In this video, we'll walk you through the basics of DaVinci Resolve, helping you get started on your journey from novice to pro. I'm Raj Hatistri and I'm excited to guide you through the essential. Let's dive in. First things first, let's take a look at the workspace. When you open DaVinci Resolve, You'll see the interface divided into several sections and pages. We have the media pool page, the cut page, the edit page, fusion page, the color page, the fair light page, and the deliver page. The deliver page allows you to render and export your video. The fair light allows you to work on your audio. The color page allows you to color grade and work on your, you know, grading and color quality. The fusion page allows you to configure and design your graphics. And the edit page is the primary place where you would work on your timeline and your video project. Now, first things first, I quickly import uh, a couple of videos. So now let's focus on the heart of your project, the timeline. This is where you arrange your clips, add transitions and craft your story. This also would primarily be done on the edit page. From over the media pool, you can create or drag your first clip to the timeline. That also creates a timeline setting based on that clip that you had selected. Now that we have our first clip, we can drag another one depending on how we fancy it. And we have a couple of nice angles that we could use in this section you can also maneuver with this just by dragging the sides depending on how you want it you can cut it by typing ctrl command b to cut the aspect you don't like you can also just delete this by doing ripple delete there are many ways you can play around with the clips on your timeline now to see your masterpiece in action you need to know your playback controls. This is a playback section. This allows you to view what you're editing and uh, just knowing what will come out in the editing, um, in the export. So these are your playback controls. You can see the, go to previous edit, go to next edit, the stop, the play, the play reverse, which plays backward. We have the loop. We have the mark in, mark out to select certain areas on the timeline. All these would go further into in the next videos as they come in the playlist. Now it's time to add some flair to your video with effects and transitions. Over here at the effects tabs, we can see video transitions. We have a couple of built-in ones like the cross dissolve, the additive dissolve, many more. And you can also import or create yours. We have audio transitions as well, crossfade, which can allow you ease into a sound. We have titles that allows you to create titles to tell a story or subtitles. We have effects, which is a very important one. We also have built-in fusion effects. We have an adjustment clip. So for example, adding titles, you can add a title over here to start your video or to end your video and you can edit this on the inspector tab over here so we can say now you can also increase the size of this how you fancy it you can adjust its position on the x-axis uh, there are so much but it depends on you we can edit how it looks we can edit the colors and all and all now that's it for our davinci resolve basics video we've covered the workspace the timeline, playback controls, and introduced you to effects and transitions. If you found this helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tutorials. Stay tuned for part two, where we will dive deeper into how to use some of these features and how to create or import yours into the project. Thanks for watching. Raj out.